Sandy, and I'm one of the Wisconsin Master Gardener volunteers. And um, we are at the Spooner Research Station. We have our display gardens, and we planted um, a vegetable garden this year. Um, all of the all of the seeds came from AAS or the All American Selection, so they were sent to us, and then we sent them to the University of Wisconsin Madison, where they grew them in the greenhouse over the winter, um, and then we got them in the spring and planted. Um, the inspiration for the vegetable garden is a farmer's market because we love going to farmer's markets and we thought that would be kind of be fun. So my husband put together a little farmer's market stand as a focal point in our garden. Um, some of the fun things that we planted, um, a couple different varieties of watermelon and we planted them and kind of guided them around the edge to have be a border. Um, and the watermelon has done really well. We have. Um, we have this uh, smaller watermelon here, and then we also have a gold watermelon, which is new to me. I've never tried them, but it looks pretty fun, and I'm excited to try it. Um, a couple things that I've never planted before um, are the kohlrabi. I've never even tried kohlrabi before, but um, it was some of the seeds that were plants that were available to us, and so I wanted to experiment and check this out. Um, normally kohlrabi, you would want to harvest it when it's about a tennis ball size, um, but this is a, a variety where they could get uh, bigger and not taste woody. Um, normally you would take a kohlrabi and you would peel it and you could slice it and eat it raw or put it into stir fry. Um, so ours have done really well, except for something that was eating the leaves. We're not quite sure what that is, but, but the, the vegetable has done well. Um, we planted strawberries that are flourishing. Um, we're really happy with those. Um, the plant that I have never um, seen before last year was an okra. And I planted these because I thought they were so beautiful when I saw them last year. Um, they're really ornamental and they flower. Their flower is very a, a tropical looking flower. Um, and then the okra itself is actually um, the base of the flower. So in, in this case, this okra would be a little too big to harvest. This would be pretty um, woody. You want to have them about one or two inches long and this is like bigger than my hand. So some of these, um, this is not quite ready yet, but I just think that it's a beautiful plant and they do so well here in Wisconsin. Um, the things um, that did not go so well um, is the ornamental peppers. They didn't grow as well as we thought that they would. Um, I'm not really sure why. I mean, some of them have little berries on them, but um, they just didn't flourish like we think, thought that they would. Um, we also have some great peppers in the back, um, and they're all different colors. So these are doing really well. Um, we have some orange, green and red ones, and um, the plants are very full of peppers. So we're pretty happy with the progress of the peppers as well. Um, all in all, we're really happy with the garden and it's been really fun to watch it grow. And uh, we look forward to people coming out and being able to take a look at our gardens. So thanks for coming and it's been great to talk to you about our vegetable garden.